Good morning, super cool party people. It's just before 10. I set an alarm for earlier and then I was like, screw that. And then I had like these crazy dreams. So there was like a monster in the house, but like it was like a dog or a lizard, I think. Like corgi-like dog or lizard of very same size. And it just wanted cuddles. But it could also go invisible. But once it cuddled it, it was all good. And it was happy. And then just weird other dreams surrounding that. But I am up now. I'm gonna try to get moving and see what I can accomplish today. All right, I'm standing upright. I think that's a win. I w it was rough, I don't know why. I've just been laying in bed, watching some videos, trying to like get get with it. So I'm up now, I'm moving, and as long as I keep moving, it should be okay. So I'm gonna make myself some breakfast. It is currently 20 after 10, and then try to have a productive day because yesterday was not very productive. The day before was me, but today should be super- Yesterday was really productive, what am I talking about? I actually wrote a blog post about this because I have this thing in my head, I guess, where if I don't do something related to my writing, I feel like I'm not productive. So yesterday I filmed two videos and I edited one and like I did a bunch of other things, so it was a productive day. <sighs> Brain's weird. Anyway, he's gonna try to have a productive writing day today. Uh, Hopefully, eventually. If not, yeah, whatever. I'm almost on vacation. All right, we've got some toast with garlic on it because I'm feeling a little... I don't know if it's because I just woke up, but I love garlic also. So I'm going to have this putter at my computer for a bit and then try to figure out a course of action in which I can be productive. It's funny, though, because, like... It's been a rough morning. We're only like an hour in and it's been a rough morning. Uh, but I've been thinking that it would be nice to like in the morning, like go swimming or something at six because there's lanes at the pool, which is pretty close to the house at 6 a.m. But I'm like, I can't even like feel my brain, never mind be able to get into a pool without drowning at this time. And it's like 10 right now. So maybe, maybe we'll try that at some point. Not. Not right now though. All right, so I just had more toast. So I've had like four slices of toast with garlic. This is, the, that's suitable for breakfast slash lunch, right? Anyway, I've been up for about two hours now and nothing has changed. I'm still in my pajamas. I am sitting at my desk. My bed is not made and I've done nothing. So I think what I'm gonna do, I'm, I'm watching Survivor. Obviously I'm watching Survivor. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna continue to watch Survivor here for a bit, but make a list of things I want to do today. Because when I have lists, I am far more productive than when I don't have lists. So that is the plan. Gotta think about what I wanna do today. I should probably edit that video before I go away. It is a little chilly in here. Uh, because if I edit that video before I go away, then I don't need to worry about it at all when I'm gone. So that would be a good thing. And then, yeah, we just, this is the last bag I need to pack. I decided to go with it. I was still like, ah, what if it's too big? But I think it'll be okay. Um, and make my bed, obviously. And if I edit a video, and then maybe work on my synopsis, that would be good. We'll see. I'm super unmotivated today. Because like I said, I'm, all, I'm basically on vacation. So today is Sunday, tomorrow is Monday. I work, have a staff meeting, and have a staff like Christmas dinner. And by dinner, I mean lunch. And then my plan is just to come home and go to sleep <laughs> at like four in the afternoon. Oh my God, and then I fly out. Oh, this is too soon. I need to print my itinerary today. All right, we got stuff to do. So we need to get on slacking and making that list. <laughs> okay, I have gotten dressed, so I think that's a win. And I'm making progress. I'm putting away my clothes right now. But the most important thing and the reason that I picked up the camera is because it's sunny, yes. And I didn't wanna not pick up the camera and show that now because there's a good chance it'll go away very soon. It's supposed to rain, potentially snow the next day and then rain, 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 rain. But at least I'm gone, but I was checking the weather for Orlando and also where the wedding is 
and it's just it's supposed to it's supposed to rain <laughs> on the wedding day but it's it's an inside venue so that's okay so it'll just the only thing that would get messed up would be any outdoor pictures i guess anyway i am in the midst of the cleaning and the packing this is the dress and um i don't know how to pack it <laughs> like without wrinkling it i mean i guess i just gotta pack it and then hang it up right away when i get down there so because it's sunday so it's about time and in all fairness when pam did bring this to me she had it like balled up very similar to this in her backpack so i'm sure it's fine i definitely just had a moment of oh maybe i should put it on my carry-on but i'm bringing all carry-on but if i was checking a bag that dress would definitely with my wedding shoes be going in my carry-on because you never know and it's better safe than sorry when i went down to jessica's wedding in mexico i had a bathing suit my shoes for the wedding and my wedding dress and i was like those are all the things i really absolutely need <laughs> and obviously the clothes i was wearing to, to kind of get through like we can figure out the rest fortunately they didn't lose my luggage which is always nice but yeah no i'm carrying everything on so it should be fine <sighs> Good times. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna continue puttering and um, finish getting this sorted, and then I don't, I got a list. I don't know if I wanna do the list, but I have a list. All right, so my room is clean. I have procrastinated a fair amount, crossed some things on my list, added some more things to my list, so now it is time to edit that video, which is fine. I definitely, definitely need to do it, and I'd much rather do it now than be stressed out about it when I'm traveling, and it's easier to write when I'm traveling than it is to edit video because it takes up so much battery power. So I'm gonna edit that now and then maybe go to the store in a bit because brain, 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 brain. We're gonna do tacos for dinner and we need the actual taco shells. It's a little bit important. We have everything else though, but I'll just pick up a taco kit and all will be well. So yeah, just, just it's an update. I'm like, I'm so happy with how tidy and clean my room is looking so this is where the rest of my tech stuff is gonna go I need to put more battery chargers and cords this is my backpack carry-on there's my carry-on suitcase and that's the outfit that I'm gonna wear plus that and the jacket and I think I might also take my Ravenclaw jacket and wear it like a super layer up because I know when I don't get a lot of sleep, I'm a little bit colder than usual, so it doesn't hurt to have extra clothes on, and um, also planes can just be really cold. I'm still thinking like I have a really nice big scarf that's like a blanket scarf, so I might bring that because I brought it last time I went down to Florida and then to Paris and back obviously, and it was so nice to just like wrap that around me and be like super duper cozy. Other than that, the only other thing I want to find, if I can, this is so backwards, is the auxiliary cord for my overhead Bluetooth earphones, because obviously you can't Bluetooth while you're on the plane, uh, so I want to find the cord. Or I might bring, you see I don't want to bring these ones because they feel like got the microphone on them, maybe I'll just jack the aux cord from there. Interesting thought. Oh, and I need to download stuff from Netflix or whatnot to watch. Okay, we got a lot of stuff to do. We need to stop slacking. We need to start doing. I'm not sure what my last update was. Did I say I finished editing my D&D video? Anyway, I did, and it is exporting now, so I am now good to upload that for next Sunday. Let's, I am a week ahead. Yay me. And I think I'm going to see if anybody wants to walk to the store with me or, like, drive me to the store because it's probably cold out there. But if not, I'll just head to the store by myself, pick up the taco kit. Hopefully they have it at that store. And then um, probably some chips, too, because I kind of want some chips. Snacky, snacky, snack. <laughs> anyway, I don't know if I'll bring the camera because usually when I go out, I bring my GoPro now because it's like a half the size easy. Uh, but I don't want to charge the batteries again before I go. So we'll see. If not, check in with you later. I still have probably half the things on my list to do. So we'll get there. Some of them are pretty easy though. Not, not, not too bad. Okay, so we went to the store. We ended up having to go downtown because there were more things that we needed to get and the grocery store near our place. The prices are good if they're on sale. If it's not on sale, it's terrible, especially pop. So we went down 
town and then we came back and we finally broke down all of Christmas and we were good because we had like a million random boxes so we put it all into a couple totes and now it's stored under the stairs so we are awesome. I'm just chilling for a bit here and then I'll start cooking dinner in about 15 minutes. Having tacos, yes I discussed that. Um, and then probably continue doing things like downloading stuff. I still haven't downloaded stuff but I've still been pretty productive. I can't believe that I'm leaving in like, I'm flying out in like 36 hours. I am not ready for this. I am so ready for this, but I am not ready for this. All right, so just had dinner. It was delicious tacos. And then I printed my itinerary stuff because that was like, I should probably do this. I mean, you really don't always need to have it, but I just feel safer having it just in case like everything goes down somehow. If like all their computer systems go down or whatnot, I can be like, well, I've got all my confirmations here. Um, or if I can't get Wi-Fi or something for some reason. So that's exciting. That's one more thing to cross off my list. I think I'm getting pretty down to the bottom on that list. Yeah, I only have like five more things to do. One is work on my synopsis, which may or may not happen. One is to blog which may or may not happen. <laughs> One is to shower, which should happen, because otherwise then I have to like shower tomorrow and then go to sleep at four in the afternoon. That's what I'm gonna try. So I'm like, maybe I'm just gonna like stay up really late tonight so I'm super exhausted. Anyways, um, and then I just wanna make sure that my Bluetooth headphones, like my little ones, work with my phone because it wasn't connecting before, and then download stuff to watch. So I think that should be what I work on now. I download a few things onto my iTunes, like some shows that I have, but I'm gonna go hit up Netflix for maybe a couple movies that I've been, you know, wanting to see but haven't bothered because, you know, I'll be a captive audience for about five hours. Well, I think it's like seven hour flight time total, but the first one's pretty short. So I'm doing very important things, like going through my old Instagram feed. <laughs> and I know I've talked about this before on this channel about how I have a problem with like how fast I can write, and maybe it's not a problem, but National Novel Writing Month in 2012, on day 13, I had over 60,000 words. Let's just, let's do some math here. I wrote like 4,600 words a day. That's ridiculous. That's why, you know, sometimes mid-month, I'm like, maybe I should do National Novel Writing Month this month, and it's, because I know I can do it. But that's crazy. I wonder what my final word count was for the month. It looks like I never fully updated. I could go back on the site and look, but I'm pretty sure I wrote like 60,000 words really fast and then I just stopped because that's what I do. I, get, I lose interest very quickly sometimes. But yeah, I am just going through that, cleaning it up a bit, and then watching some Netflix. Still haven't figured out what I want to download, but I'm watching a pilot of a show that I haven't seen before to see if it's worth downloading some of those for the trip. Alrighty, so it is just after 10 now. Actually, it's like closer to 10.30, but I finally downloaded stuff from Netflix. I was gonna say Netflix. It's weird. Anyways, I finally <laughs> downloaded stuff from Netflix. I've done a lot of my list today. I didn't do like the actual like super productive things. Actually, you know, I did it, but I did some productive things. I didn't do all productive things. Uh, I didn't write though, and so it feels like a wasted day, as it always does for some reason. Anyway, um, feeling pretty good regardless about what I did. I'm going to probably go to sleep here soon. Oh, it's so few hours until I fly out. I mean, I don't fly out tomorrow, but uh, I have a busy day tomorrow and then hopefully go to sleep early. That would be super helpful. I'm gonna shower too, because I didn't shower today. I'm the worst. Anyway. <laughs> Ramble, ramble, ramble. And with that, I'm going to say thank you for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. <laughs> Good night.